Hello. So James is here with James is here with me today because I was waffling on about my new 335 and I was telling him how much better it is than his one. So I was like, bye. <laughs> it's only better because it runs and mine is broken. There you go. <laughs> never said it was like technically better, I just said that it's Better. Logistically better. Yeah. So today we're here in the 35 and we're taking the sand apart because I want him to see, you know, the beautiful British drift scene. Quite impressed about so far is the amount of cars that are here and the amount of people that are driving. Yeah. It's it's really good entry. I think 80 something cars here on a Wednesday. What's um, everybody? I said this last time. What's everybody doing? <laughs> <laughs> Davis is just recording up his nose somewhere. No, it's good. It's good. Look, we're going to have a little look, we're going to have a little drive. Yeah, we're just going for a bit of crack. Yeah, so let's go and have a look. Let's Irish a look for fun, not drugs. <laughs> also, FYI, this is not a hickey on my neck. No, it is. I've just come back from four days in Joro and like I've broken my nail. I got, a, I got like... Well, I hope you didn't come back from Spain on a hickey. No. No, but people don't notice it. I see people looking at it and they go, they look at it and they go... And then just look away, but it's, it's just like... Oh, look, the scab's lifting on it now. Oh, it's like a perfect square where the handlebar punched me straight in the neck. And I got, ow! And then I got a nice, like, I got a nice few injuries from that trip. Mm. It's yeah, great. Stick to four wheels, babe. Absolutely loved it. Back on two wheels, smash my face off. Oh, no bother. Although the scab is starting to, oh, you know, when it's at that point where, like, you want to pick it, but you can't. Look at that, beautiful. <laughs> oh, look at it, it's disgusting. Oh, you nasty. You know, because the conditions are kind of patchy, you can't snap every single transition like no. you would in the S15 because you don't have the angle to catch it. But you know, and you are being more cautious with the transitions, and it's working nice. And what you, I never. Now I've got used to you telling me to never take hands off the wheel, so I actually follow it round. Yeah, you don't always have to follow it, but like I, I personally dislike when people like let go of the wheel and watch it spin. <laughs> and like, oh, the car has full control. Because, like, you know, if you hit a bump or something happens, different things. It's nice just to be really close to the wheel all the time. Yeah. And I see that you're getting much better with that. Well done. Thank you. I just, like, oh, when you hit the wet. Like, what do you, when you're in a pro car, like, what do you even do when that happens if you're You're just always chat? ready because you're so used to it. Like, if you know it's going to be wet in a certain area of the track, you just get ready with the clutch. So you're... I'm always driving, even if it's not fully um, wet, if it's perfectly dry, you're used to controlling the car with the clutch. Like that's an extra tool you have. It's like having an extra five degrees of steering angle. Just press the clutch when you're all all there and buys you buys you a little bit of time. But do you know what I also realise that I do is I'm leaning on the clutch a little bit, you know, like I use it as a, a safety. No, but that's okay. Like, uh, on try, off, yeah, yeah, on or off yeah. it, like, just to disengage for a second. Yeah. Alright, cool, didn't die, that's good news. Right. Well done. Thank you. Do you have any tires? Yeah, that's good to do that. Bang, 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 bang. That's what I hate about street tires. This tire still at 50% left. 
Oh, I didn't take the photo. Oh, I didn't steal Every the trash time. for sure. <laughs> Every time! I uh. swear to God! strangers because I've just been in like one two three three bangs with you when you're following randomers because they get stressed that you're following them and then they do something and then well, it's, it's like... always the person behind then crashes in because the person in front spins out every single time with a bash I mean I trust you implicitly yeah I wouldn't do anything silly <laughs> tires are gone anyway just in time for your heart thank you <laughs> right then guys that's another successful day with the 335 the more I drive this thing, the more confident I get. And it's been brilliant to have James over today just to kind of get a feel for it. Just make sure that everything is running right on it and give me some pointers. Like I've never driven that track like that. So it's really good to have his, do I want to say tuition? Is it tuition? I guess it kind of is. James is driving the beautiful Defender 90 that I have with me, which has been the perfect support vehicle. We get to drive home in comfort. But what did you think of the day, the track, the car? Great place for seat time. Yeah, big, big thank you to the guys, Mr. Colgate at Drift What You Brung for having us down. He's been extremely helpful and just sort of let us run amok for the day. So a big thank you to him. And guys, yeah. like when these days open back up again, I can't stress enough how fun it is to come down. And there's so many learning areas as well. So if you're new to drifting and you don't want to go out on the big track, there is like four different paddocks where you can bring the car, get to learn your clutch control, get to learn yeah, your hand rate. figures of eight. So yeah. It's been a good day. Make sure you get yourself down to Santa Pub when these days open back up again. We're going to get loaded up, get him on a plane. He's got to head back because we have some uh, more drifting. There's so much drifting going on at the minute. A lot of, it's like the calm before the storm. It's like practice days and mm. stuff like that. So I'm taking a Mustang out again this weekend. Mm -hmm. Then we're testing in America next week. Mm -hmm. And then Long Beach is just around the corner. So It's coming around fast. Yeah. Right. Look forward to it second day where my 335 has driven itself to a good day and driven oh, itself that's back. impressive not american beautiful right gang we will see you on the next video take care of yourselves ciao ciao bye